Hello everybody, Abolitionist Jay here with today's vlog. It's currently about 5.30 on July, uh, geez, July 11th, 2018. Murder Dog and I are currently sitting at what used to be our backyard, the Wanto Marina. You know, the one we were uh, hanging out in until we were so unceremoniously removed by security one night. But that's okay, we found a much better uh, stealth camping spot that we've been hanging out lately that we like. There's a uh, Murder Dog, Cameron. There she is. She's hanging out at the back. We just came back from the dog park, our second trip to the dog park today. Uh, since uh, since yesterday's vlog, we once again ended up at our uh, new favorite place for the night. Uh, it was a little warm yesterday, as I mentioned, so it was a little bit warmer last night. So we were a little uncomfortable for uh, the first half of the night, and then the temperature started to drop a lot, so it was much better. Woke up early again, uh, you know, a little before 6 o'clock, but, you know, that gave us time to get up, get out, stretch our legs a little bit, and uh, wander, wander around the commercial park before people started showing up for work. Gave me an opportunity to have my coffee out on the uh, back porch again. And then we headed off to uh, the dog park to start the day because we actually had to drop the element off at uh, the dealership today to get some work done. So we did the dog park first, then went and took my shower, then we dropped the car off and kind of hung out there. Luckily, the uh, dealership was nice enough to let us hang out inside, even though, I, you know, they, they usually have a no-dog policy. But she was cool. She just passed out on the floor. So we just hung out there for an hour and a half or so till the car was done. And then we ran to ran off to meet up with the kids uh, for they had an eye doctor appointment today, which, of course, they were all nervous of last time. they One of the last times they went, they had to get those drops. You know, you remember those as a kid. You know, most kids are running out of there screaming after they get those in their eyes. So they're all worried about that. Luckily, they did not need those today. It was just a, kind of a routine checkup thing. Uh, unfortunately, neither of them slept last night. Apparently, they both had a really rough night, so they were just exhausted. Uh, getting them out of the house to the appointment was tough enough as it is. And even taking them to 7-Eleven afterwards, because, well, it's July 11th, 7-Eleven. It's uh, National Slurpee Day. You get a free small Slurpee if you go to 7-Eleven on, on, on this day, so... We went there, but even that couldn't get them out of their funk. They still, they both finished like, a, you know, half or two thirds of their slurping. We're both like, ah, oh, we're done. We want to go home. We're tired. And apparently, one of my daughters, as soon as she got back to the apartment, crawled right into her bed to try to take a nap. So they were wiped, which unfortunately means we could not hang out with them for very long. But at least we got to see them, and we got a really cool picture. Uh, a couple of them actually, uh, thanks to Jen. And uh, I'm sure I'm one of those will probably end up being the uh, picture for this uh, this vlog, but. We, uh, you know, so that that was fun, and, uh, you know, like I said, at least I got to see him and hang out with them for a little bit. Hopefully they get some rest tonight so I can hang out with them for a long period tomorrow because then, you know, Friday I'll see them for one of their doctor's appointments, and then uh, I'm supposed to head off to Pennsylvania after that for the uh, weekend of camping with Murder Dog and I. So, like I said, hopefully they will feel, they will feel better tomorrow, and uh, we'll get to spend more time with them. But otherwise, you know, aside from only getting to see them for a short time, hasn't been too bad of a day was kind of warm earlier when we were in the uh, doctor's appointment earlier. I did have to leave the car running with the AC on for Murder Dog just in case, which actually ended up working out well because we were in there for over an hour. And then, uh, but now the temperature has started to drop, although the sun just came back out again. It starts starting to feel a little warm, but the temperature definitely felt like a 10 degree drop. And uh, down here at the marina, there's a nice breeze going on. So we're nice and cool. So luckily the AC was only needed for that little brief stretch today. And uh, yeah. I think that's uh, that's about it. Like I said, you know, pretty good day. Hoping to uh, see the kids longer tomorrow, and then you know, we're uh, like less than two days away from us to, from Murder Dog and I taking off again, and uh, going to scout out a camping location for the kids and I, which we will hopefully get to do, use very soon. You know, maybe even like next week sometime, especially since I got my uh, trial date starting the uh, following Monday. But we'll see. Either way, I definitely uh, plan on taking them somewhere so I can spend some uh, quality dad and kid time. Just, the, you know, hopefully just the three of us and just hang out for a while. But so with that, oh, now, of course, there's a helicopter going overhead. I never know if these things actually get picked up on the mic or not, because whenever I say it, I listen back. I don't hear it. If I don't say it, then I listen back and I do hear it. Whatever. I'll say it anyway. You might have heard a helicopter. It seems to be gone now, but. Like I said, with that, I think I will sign off. I just wanted to record a quick vlog now. Uh, Murder Dog and I are actually going to head out of here soon because got to go up to the Sprint store, look about finally uh, switching my plan over to another another service. 
as much as I've loved Ting all these years, it is just not working out while I'm on the road. I've already hit the five gigabyte limit uh, with like eight days this eight days left on the on the uh, on the on the you know the, on the month. Uh, so for the second month in a row, the bill is going to be a lot higher than I'm used to. So I think I'm finally going to have to you know break down and go ahead and get a uh, go back to one of the big carriers and uh, hopefully get an unlimited plan or at least something a lot more uh, conducive to my usage out here while I'm on the road and you know even though I have thanks to a couple of a couple of wonderful people I now have uh, you know inter- I have Wi-Fi access with a cup with uh, with Optimum and Xfinity and uh, you know there's plenty of other Wi-Fi spots around here it just doesn't seem to matter telegram unfortunately runs constantly and that you know that chews up data i used a hell of a lot of data on my on my last trip using Waze the entire time so yeah it's finally time i'm gonna have to go back you know when i lived at home it was easy because you know i'd use some data out during the day but for the most part i used a lot of the stuff while i was at home while i was on wi-fi was never an issue rarely went over the two gig limit which which is supposed to be the limit uh or at least uh, what they have a plan for up to two gigs anything after up over two gigs you pay per you know per whatever megabyte so yeah gonna have to bite the bullet and do that figure i'll just go to sprint only because i use ting right now which actually uses the sprint network to begin with or at least in my area it does so you know i'll get the same crappy service but whatever at least there'll be something i'm used to so we're gonna go check that out and then uh I was supposed to record a Fiends episode tonight with Diana Kyler. Haven't heard from her, so I'm not sure if that's actually going to happen. As I've mentioned before, I have had some issues trying to do recordings uh, lately after having great success the first couple of times. So we'll see what happens with that. But other than that, we're gonna, you know, we're gonna go check out the phone stuff, and then, you know, if we don't hear from Diana, we're probably gonna end up going back to our spot, maybe a little early, and uh, hang out there for the night. And uh, get prepped for tomorrow. And like I said, we'll hopefully be hanging out with the kids for as long as possible. So with that, now I will definitely sign off. This has been Abolitionist Jay. Thank you, everybody, always for watching. Thank you for your continued support and questions and comments and whatnot. And, uh, of course, if you ever feel like uh, chipping in a little bit more other than just upvoting and re-steaming this stuff, which, again, please do so. If you watch this on Steemit and you do have a Steemit account, please consider doing so. I really appreciate it. And even if you have, like, you know, no upvote power, plenty of my friends are like, oh, it's not worth anything. I don't care. Makes me feel good. Do it, man. Do it. <laughs> anyway, so, yeah, I've, if, but if you don't want to do that, there's other uh, links usually in the show notes. Uh, the page, This SOL Patreon account, which is... Uh, uh, you know, which I control anyway, and then a couple of different crypto addresses, uh, which uh, we are not opposed to receiving donations if you uh, are so inclined, if you like what we're doing over here. So once again, thank you, everybody, and uh, we'll catch you tomorrow. Peace, y'all. Say bye, Mutter Dog. Gammy? Yeah, she's out cold. Later, folks. <laughs>